Hi everybody, welcome to Dracula Media. If you want to learn how to take pictures like mine, keep watching. Okay, first on our list is the Makey MKC Up. This allows us to reverse mount our lens to the camera, also allows the camera to control the aperture whilst the lens is reversed. Next we have the Viltrox extension tube rings. This allows us to shoot at a closer distance with higher magnification. The Photo R 62-58mm mil step down ring adapter allows us to reverse mount our lens to the adapter. The Rolson Tools heavy duty helping hand. This helps us to hold the different subjects close to the camera easily. One last thing you will need a source of light. I'm using this YN600EX RT2 flash. Okay guys. Our lens 50mm Canon 1.4 We have here our step down ring Now the step down ring I need for this particular lens is a 58mm Now we're gonna screw the step down ring into the front of the lens Just like that Okay guys so now our Makey reverse mount we take one side of it and screw it to the lens. As you see, this allows us, this particular bit allows us to mount the lens reversed on the camera. What you want to do now is put the extension tubes. It's up to you how many you want to use. The more extension tubes you will use, the greater magnification and also the more light you will lose. So more extension tubes, greater magnification, less light, more artificial light you need to put in. Now the other part from the reverse mount This goes on the rear of the lens. And there you go, this is the full setup. So let's recap. Extension tubes, step down ring. You will have this uh, to suit your particular lens. Mine is a 58 millimeter. 50 millimeter lens reversed. And then the Makey reverse mount. This allows the camera to control the lens even though it's reversed. Okay everyone, this is the full setup. I've got a flower mounted in my hand helping hands. I'm working on aperture priority. Aperture set at f4, ISO 100. Timer two seconds, let's take the shot. There you go. Okay guys, that was it. Hope it's not too complicated. I do assume that you have basic knowledge of camera settings, working with manual mode, aperture, shutter speeds, ISO and all that. If you enjoyed the video, give it a like, subscribe to the channel. Until the next time, see you later.